Stonewall Columbus's big pride celebration is back in person for the first time since before the pandemic, and it was a sea of rainbows in downtown Columbus as thousands of people celebrated 41 years of pride. 10 TV's Kiana Dietis was right in the middle of it. This year's theme, the People's Pride, put people front and center here, and it was a welcoming atmosphere for all people with a sea of rainbow flags. Led by the Columbus Pride Band, more than 17,000 people marched down High Street to support and celebrate Central Ohio's LGBTQ plus community. This event's very welcoming, especially for me. I had my first Pride in Cleveland a couple weeks ago and it felt very affirming to have a lot of people just accept me for who I am. After the March, the Pride Festival picked up at Goodale Park with resources and live entertainment for everyone to enjoy. And it's like so mainstream now, which is really cool because it means like more people are aware of the community and it's more accepted, which is amazing. Stonewall Columbus says its Pride events this year will attract more than 700,000 visitors some experiencing Columbus Pride for the first time. I am really excited. Um, I've only been to two Pride festivals in Cleveland and this is my first time in Columbus, so I'm really excited to see how this city does it. And the celebration does not end here. Next week, Stonewall will host the Network and Land Grant Family event and the Stonewall Pride 5K. In Goodale Park, Keanu Deitches, 10 TV News. A lot going on this weekend, and the fun is not done tonight. The Pride Festival runs until 8 o'clock this evening.